Now let us see when you have both at the beginning and in the beginning. At the beginning is used for the time and place when something begins. For example, we are going to Japan at the beginning of July. Next, there is a short poem at the beginning of every chapter. You will be seeing a short poem on, on homophones in our exhibition. Next, what's the uh, use? Why is in the beginning used? In the beginning suggests a contrast with the later situation, which means I thought he loved me, perhaps he did in the beginning. This means that he loved her in the beginning, but now he does not. You can say we are going to Japan in the beginning of July. No, you can say that at the beginning of July. Is this the wrong? At the beginning, yeah, that's wrong. At the beginning it is used for time and place when something begins. No, and also, also, remember one thing. At the beginning, which is not beginning, at the beginning, stressing on the second syllable, at the beginning, invariably collocates with preposition or. You usually you don't do not say in the beginning of. In the beginning, okay. but at the beginning of. Okay, so that factor is. And, and one thing you can tell the guests: uh, none of these sentences are my making. All these sentences have been taken from these teachers. No, 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 no just I am teaching them also. Teaching them also. So all the examples are and their abbreviations are this. 